You ready? Let's do it. Hey, what's going on? Charlie here. I'm Jean. Thank you for tuning in to the Christmas edition, if you, if you can't tell, Multicasters. Ho, ho. Ho, 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 indeed. <laughs> Merry Christmas to you. Uh, so for a Christmas episode, we thought we would do Maker's Mark Christmas edition, which comes with this handy dandy if you're ever in uh, Loretto, Kentucky. Free tour pass attached to there. Huh. For you and a guest. So it's a Christmas present from them to you. So if you see the holiday edition out, grab it. Comes with a uh, free tour pass. Nice. Distillery tour pass. This is the 2019. 2019 edition, yep. 2019 edition. Yep. So we're going to go ahead and uh, uncork this here right quick. If my hands are. Oh, look at that. I can, I can get it. I have good hands. <clears throat> you know what I got? I got skills. You know, like nunchuck skills, bow hunting skills. Computer hacking skills. So those of you who are not familiar uh, with uh, Maker's Mark, they have the traditional wax dip uh, topping. So. Nice. Uh, screw off, as it turns out. <laughs> screw off, as it turns out. I forgot <laughs> it's a screw off. <clears throat> Rookie mistake, right? Uh, so this is a 100% weeded whiskey. Nice. Which is nice. This I'm is gonna a, let you pour for me. I appreciate that. She does the heavy pours. I do. I try to stay about a half an ounce on my pours for testing. I like to make sure I have a good amount to taste. Yeah. And I'm gonna screw this cap back into place. Good. As it as it deserves. Uh, so yeah. So Merry Christmas. Uh, let us know down in the comments if you get a bottle for Christmas. I'm curious what you got for Christmas, or if you asked for a bottle for Christmas, what did you ask for? I'm curious about that. Uh, spoiler alert, by the time this comes out, brother-in-law Ryan, uh, who some of you folks might know from our uh, Hot Ones reviews, uh, is getting a bottle of whiskey from us this year for Christmas. Which kind did, are we getting him? I haven't decided yet. I was going to get him a nice bottle, but then today we went over to his house to pick up some 80 Laws that he just got back from Colorado to give us, and he's like, mm -hmm. I want a Christmas pack. So oh, that's right. I might have to get him one of those. So we have we have some of those back here. We have a compass box, a Johnny Walker, and a blue orange. So on the nose, I'm getting um, some cinnamon, mm. brown sugar, um, the normal Oak. bourbon. I'm I'm getting bourbons, the the coffee, not not the coffee, the, the creamy caramel toffees. Okay, so I said that a lot in one episode, and now he gives me a hard time. It needs to be a shirt. Uh, I'm getting some char, which I normally don't get, but I'm getting some char out of this. Hmm. Uh, they are, yeah, there's they, char in there. Yeah, they are 100% weeder whiskey, so a weeded whiskey, so it's going to be a sweeter nose. I get the sweet. I, I get some hay. Uh, Weller's is another one that's 100% weeded whiskey. Mm -hmm. Hey, I get that. Hey. Every time. Every time. Every time. It doesn't get old to me. <laughs> yeah, it's got a, a hint of uh, spearmint. Mm. It's got a solid nose. Maker's mm. Mark is pretty consistent. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have a good one. Oh, me too. One more. No. Sniff. Cinnamon, pepper, hay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Barn floor. Pretty much everything that was on the nose. Dust. Is what I'm tasting right now. Yep. It's like I said. It's a consistent, mm -hmm. consistent yep. uh, dram. Um, I get the caramels. Corn. Well, that's a weeded whisk, but I might get corn. A sweeter note. But a very sweet caramel. Kind of like you would get in a, uh, um, maybe a touch of chocolate, actually. Because I was going to say, if you put a, a, no. a caramel in like a, a bucket of hot popcorn, some people do that in movie theaters, they put like the milk duds in there, and you get that popcorn in your mouth, it's got the milk dud chocolate on there. Boom. That's mm. exactly what that tastes like. I'm getting some um, pecans. You know, like that, uh, is that a, I'm not even going to look at you. Is that, is it a, is it a turtle? Is that what it's called with yeah. the caramel and the, and the cr crunched up pecans? Mm-hmm. That's what I'm, that's what it tastes like. Kind of like a turtle cheesecake, but without the cheesecake. So, okay. turtle. Okay. Yeah, it's consistently good. It's smooth. It's mm -hmm. not harsh. There's no burn whatsoever. It is a solid weeded whiskey. And Maker's Mark is consistent. They got the cool little bottle. They, they got the, the nice snowflake here for us. Uh, so, yeah. No water. Oh, yeah, yeah. Give us a roll. It's been a while since I put water in a, in a uh, 
Mm -hmm. We did whiskey. Uh, Maker's Mark, it's 45 ABV. So it's right there for you uh, people who like the higher proofs. It's, it's above 45. And it is 45. I didn't change those for me. No. Uh -uh. And if you like the lower proofs, it's only 45. Either way, it works out. It's a crowd pleaser. It did for me, it added a uh, like lemon peel, not the actual lemon, but just the skin, the peel of the lemon. Mm. Touch of vanilla now. Yeah, I'm getting vanilla on the tongue. On the tongue. Easy for you to say. Yeah. And get it on the tongue. <laughs> I prefer more of a, uh, the, 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 I'm getting a lot of cinnamons instead of peppers. Um, it, it's, Pepper girl. It's, it's like a candy, a cinnamon candy apple. Um, without the apple. Maybe a, like a cinnamon hard candy even. Okay. I can see that. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't quite have the flavor. See, cinnamon hard candies come with those, the, the, the red mylar, uh -huh. pop apart, pop them in. They have a, a punchy in the face, cinnamon, full flavored bodied candy. This does not have quite that much to me. What? It's like Agree Christmas. To disagree. It's like Christmas in your mouth. We're not hearing that before. What rum chata? Mm -hmm. Christmas in your mouth. His sister, Megan, said that one time. Christmas in your mouth. So rum chata is a liqueur. We never had it at that time, and she said, "Just picture Christmas in your mouth. That's what rum chata tastes like." Mm -hmm. I guess we could have done rum chata for a Christmas episode. Oh, we could have, but we chose this. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, so, uh, score. Right, score time. This is a solid, I mean, it's Maker's Mark. It's a solid intro level dram. It's 100% weeded. Um, yeah, another all it. Oh, horrible penmanship. Horrible penmanship. New marker, horrible, same penmanship. Who knew the marker didn't change the penmanship? See an eraser down. Oh here. man. Here's one. Here's an eraser. <laughs> yeah, I won't, I won't do a spoiler. Let me just get this out of here. It looks like if you can think of a, a Frankenstein without an opposable thumb and he's drunk trying to write. That's what I just did there. Jeez Louise. Yeah, I just yeah. This my marker's not writing very well. Yeah. I think my marker. I think my markers had too much to drink. 89, what'd you do? I did 87. Did you really? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, it's just it's it's not everything that was in the nose was in the on the palate. Um, there wasn't anything different about it. There wasn't. I mean, it was exactly what I was expecting. Um, mm -hmm. I mean, it's a solid weeded drink. Yeah. I mean, there's nothing glorious about it. There's nothing off-putting about it. It is what it is. But Gene, is it worth it? Um, What'd you pay for it? This was about thirty-five dollars. Thirty-five doll hairs. Uh -huh. Is it worth it? Uh, yeah, I'd say it's worth it. I mean, it's not terribly expensive. It's, nope. It's a. Mm -hmm. You're underwhelmed. It sounds uh, like. Yeah, I am. I'm underwhelmed. Could yeah. it be because you've been spoiled with what we've had lately? It could. It could have been. I was yeah. uh, kind of expecting it to be along the lines of of what we've been tasting. But you've had Maker's Mark before. You knew what it was. We had the cast strength. Oh, that's right, we did. You're right, this is actually our first Maker's Mark. We've had Maker's Mark in, in bourbon bars before, but never in our own house. Right. Okay, that makes more yeah, sense. Yeah, I did not know okay. what to expect, I, but uh, it's too cinnamony. 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 But you know what we have to do now, since you just told everybody we have the Maker's Mark cast strength, that we're gonna have to at some point review the Maker's Mark cast strength. Do we still have it? I believe so. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, we have a little bit. We have a skosh. We'll do a skosh. You know what we'll do? We'll do a skosh review. Skosh. We have a skosh review. Uh, so, anything to add? Nothing. Nothing? Uh, if you do pick up their holiday edition, do not throw away the tag because that is a free distillery tour for you and for a buddy, uh, pal, friend of mine. Anything to add, Gene? You already asked me that. No. Oh, that's a no. I'm Charlie. And I am Gene, and I hope you're just as thirsty as we are. Boom.